Let all of those who read this know that I have not failed my duties to the SCP Foundation. I have not broken under stress, nor have I gone crazy. What has happened is that I cannot allow the events around me to continue any longer. I am going to die. After hours in solitary confinement, and the time in between being almost unbearable, I've come to conclude that my actions after this writing will unquestionably lead to my demise. If you find this before I die, do not try to stop me. I've made my peace with God and decided that what I'm going to do is the right thing. What I'm about to do is break every single special personnel requirement for the project I'm assigned to. Normally, I wouldn't do this. But I just can't let her suffer any longer. Even though I will die trying, she will know that somebody cares for her. It will only be for a moment, maybe less. I don't care. Just as long as she's out of her torment for one second, it will be enough for me. It will be enough knowing that, for that brief instant, she will know that she is not a prisoner, that she is not a monster that somebody cares enough about her to do something about it. For that brief instant, she'll be free. I have passed all these psychological examinations. I have not broken down. I don't love her. I don't want an XK. All I want is for her to know for the briefest instant that somebody cares for her as a human being. And I will make sure she knows. Agent Shields, Note, at 0900 hours, Agent Shields stripped off his concealing helmet and somehow entered the enclosure of 231-7. 231-7 was awake at the time, but showed no reaction to Shields' presence. Armed guards were deployed as he approached the bedside, placed a single rose upon it, and left the containment chamber. Four minutes after the security breach, Agent Shields was shot to death by six guards, and 231-7's amnestic schedule was altered slightly to allow for a dose shortly afterward. Procedure 110 Montauk was put into effect minutes later. End of file. To learn more about the SCP Foundation, subscribe to SCP Orientation Today and turn the notification bell on so you don't miss any of our videos.